Come on, wake it up, wake it up, boy. You already know, motherfucking diesel talk. We diving fresh off into this shit, you know what I'm saying? Straight like this. We got X4, you feel what I'm saying? On all Urban Central, you feel me? Sending shots out at WAC 100. You know, a lot of people seem like they get into it with WAC. Of course, we all know that. But check what he got to say though, because it be some real shit. Whoever side you take, who side y'all taking? What's going on? Let's do a breakdown. Damn, bro. I heard about it, but damn, I'm about to go sit for myself. <laughs> my dead homies. Hey, bro, I love to look at this nigga exposed face and how you always be saying that? On the dead homies. Hey, because that nigga be serious. In his own head, that nigga be serious as a motherfucker. You can tell. Don't ever go on no jumper, bro. On the dead Don't homies. ever. <laughs> and say, hold on. Damn. He check his shit off the dribble. Don't ever. Y'all niggas know what don't ever means? Don't ever. So when the nigga say that, don't ever. Yeah, that's how you doing it. That's my how you dead homies. Don't ever go on no jumper, bro. On the dead homies. And say, on the dead homies, you ain't signed me because I'm controlled, bro. I'm not on my own man. Go on, right there. Wack gave examples in this interview on No Jumper about he don't fuck with rappers that, that, that are controlled. Now, it could have been took in that interview that he was directed towards X4, but he didn't say his name though. He didn't. He he, he didn't say that X4. He, he did not say the man's name. He did not say I don't sign artists like 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 X4 because woo 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 woo. He got all these homies around and this that and the other. You know what I'm saying? And I and I, and I do I do understand what Wack is saying uh, by their measures. I do. A motherfucker has to be their own man. You feel what I'm saying? Point blank. Period. You can't let the homies dictate everything because if you let them dictate everything, then it's like nigga. He's like I didn't I, I didn't sign the hood. I, I, I didn't sign the hood. I signed you. So there's some there's some you know. He's right about what he's saying. But um, uh, right. Yeah, yeah. Let's go. No, me. I'm a dead homie. I ain't never been controlled by nothing. I'm a dead homie. Big but spirit. I guess X4 took Ooh, it like that. X4 took it like, nigga, hold on. We talking about me. So in the same time, in the same sentence that you're talking about me, you, you say this type of shit like right after? Hell no, nigga. You meant that, yeah, towards me. So and I can see how you like, like that. Cool. I'm a kid. A dead homie don't know me. I'm a dead homie. West side homies. West side homies. homies. And stop saying, I'm the dead homies. You got me lit, bro. I'm crippled. You took a picture next to me. That shit don't mean nothing, bro. I'm the dead homies. You took a picture with a hundred other artists. I'm fucking okay. No other artists. But they always that music still bump tongue. <laughs> it's still bump trunk. Hey, no, that is, that's true right there. I feel it's full on that part right there. Tell me what y'all think in the comments, man. You know what I'm saying? Because you know how it is in LA, man. You know what I'm saying? With, with the culture, you know, the gangbanging culture, and then all these up and, up and coming artists out of out of everywhere it seems like right now. And you know, whack deals with a lot of the management and all that, such and such, such and such. So it's like, yeah. Do I feel like Wack was like, 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 kind of like riding, riding, like, like off that picture, like, like, yeah, nigga, you took a picture with me. You know what I'm saying? Do I think he brought that type of energy to the picture? And then after that, hell yeah, Wack feels like that, Wack, because, because look, I feel like he feels like, damn, I didn't get the nigga. And X4 is a nigga that's, he climbing, you know what I'm saying? So I feel like all of them was in a, niggas was in a tussle, 600, you know what I'm saying? All of them was kind of making it seem like, nigga, they, they managing this dude. And he telling him that's not the motherfucking case. He done been said that in the other interviews, but now he's addressing this shit with whack. I'm crazy, but you took a picture next to me. That shit don't mean nothing, bro. I'm like, damn, you took a picture with a hundred other artists. I'm fucking okay, no other artists. <laughs> but damn, that music still bump tongue. Bump tongue. Okay. I got myself lit. I'm I got right myself right. lit. And you ain't signed me. He was like, your bad button, right? Damn. damn. Like that. He Hold on right there. He said to me, your bad wasn't right. Straight like that. Hey, so now we gotta ask ourselves with the business state of mind. You feel me? If 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 if, if Wack could afford the bag, Wack would have offered it, huh? Straight like that. Cause I feel like Wack feels the X4, yeah, he he knows he's gonna be something, you know what I'm saying, with that rap shit. So I, I feel like, yeah, that, that could possibly there's some there could be some truth possibly that. Y'all gotta let me know what y'all think, man. Cause I feel like it ain't it ain't nothing been on X4 like just out here on the internet with no niggas and this, that, and the other, like. You know, he might have his little bump ins or run ins and shit like that, but I feel like, nah, this type of shit, he, he really ain't been getting to. So it's like, yeah, we trying to get down to it. So y'all let me know what y'all think, man. Come on. Okay, man, you want that? You never brought a number up. That's why he signed me. He said you never brought a number up. It's really clear. Compare him with no email, email here to me. Talk about, yeah, he said, don't compare me with no nigga with no 
emo here. Nigga, so he getting it blue face. He getting on the camp now. Nigga, see, this is what I'm saying. <laughs> this is how I start, you feel me? He getting on the camp now, getting on, getting on wax yeah, parties. Yeah, you never wanted to know That's my inside. Right. And see, from the crib, compare when the emo here to me, talk about, yeah, on the damn sign, blue face, I'm crib, I don't have to go talk to the schoolyard, but if I sign this phone, he control. Dead homies. I don't really crib, bro. Go back 10 years, 8 years, 7 years ago, dead homies. Cuz got picture doing all. Cuz is an internet type, bro. I'm a dead homie. Why do you just keep saying that's for dead movies? He said, why do you just keep different type of cribs, two different type of. I don't really crib. Dead homies. I want to sign some dead homies. And in and, and past interviews, see what's so cool about this shit in LA and, and, and in California, this is how this shit be working. Whatever happened between the two, with, with the picture taken, we know he didn't sign, but we know there was like a gathering or a meeting or they called Wack down there, he met X Fold, this, that, and the other. And they seemed to be cool after that. There was no problems, you feel me? There was no problems. Nobody wasn't talking about motherfuckers in the in no interviews or nothing. Uh X Fold did that interview after that and they asked him what's up, I think with uh 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 what's it uh uh damn I can't think of the nigga out the bay. Uh I can't think of his channel. The inner uh what is it called? Man, fuck. But I think he'd been on a couple channels. By the way, and, and he already said that like after when he had, when I asked about whack, he was like, oh yeah, whack it, you know what I'm saying? Whack straight, whack straight, 600 straight, you know what I'm saying? Now, no, in this one, he's on the niggas. So that's what I'm saying, how things can change that fast. And the only way things can change, I feel like, is whack had that, whack had to show or do something additionally with what Expo is talking about because Expo has had nothing to say when asked about you but something good to this point right here. So it had to be something he was feeling. And like he said, what he's feeling, he's feeling like, nigga, you was riding out like you was gonna sign him and all this and that. So it's like, okay, that might've been the case at one one part of the time. We, we might be trying to see about it or see what's gonna happen or the, right, his options is open, but it didn't happen. So there's no reason to keep shit going as if like, Nigga, now you, 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 you like big, trying to big homie me, like, nigga, yeah, like, nigga, you know who you talk to, yeah, nigga, ooh, you know, he got a, he was in a picture with, ooh, all this, that, and the other, so I do feel that part, because you don't want to know, and that's how the business gets bad, and that's how friendships get bad, and we see right now, what's going on. That's it, anyway, you went in there and started talking all that business. Dead he said, I don't want to be signing you anyway, you went in there and talked all that business. On the dead on the dead that's two different type of cribs, two different type of, on the road crib, dead homies. I want to sign your beard ass anyway. You went in there and started talking all their business. Dead homies. Start talking about all your artist business. Putting all their business up there. Dead homies. Fold crib. You talk like a hoe. I don't want to sign it up like you. You know, the internet. Dead homies. I do other shit. My name is known for other shit. You know I'm playing on this internet. Oh, stay in your place. Oh, nigga, stay in your place. I keep saying, I put up by myself to the crips. Like, bro, stop making a scene. Like, you don't got them. Hold on. Hold on. Say, hold on. You know I'm playing on this internet. Oh, stay in your place. Glove hats. It is, I keep saying, I put up by myself to the Crips. Like, bro, stop making a scene. Like, you don't, y'all don't, you don't beef with us, bro. On the dead movies, bro. Right. You right. don't beef with us, bro. Right. Come right. I see you put up on some copy Crips. Then you can say, okay, y'all put up to the Crips by myself. Right. Hey, so we, said, we are not the Crips. You beef with niggas, so of course you can pull up. Duh. That's what he's saying. On the dead homies, bro. You pull up to the Roto 40s, bro. On the dead homies, it's 600. On the dead homies, you not in love danger? Weird ass. On oh, Crippin, you pulled up, you had four. I'm oh, sorry, so stop getting on the internet lines and you pulled up by yourself. Like, what do you say, 600? You ain't in no danger? On the dead homies, it's 600. It's 600. On the dead homies, you not in no danger? Weird ass. On oh, Crippin, you pulled up, you had four. I'm oh, sorry, so stop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He said, hey, when you, hey, 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 he said 600, you ain't in no danger. See, this is what I'm saying. Damn, now he on, nigga, he just two pocket niggas. Now he on 600. But this is the way, I guess, how he feel. He's saying how he feel, man, so. You know, we're gonna see if it can be worked out or whatever, man, because this is the type of stuff on the coast that we deal with and we go through. And it's like, this is what keeps motherfuckers from priming because niggas be creating this beef before shit even gets started. And it don't have to be that way. And it's always a, it's always one of the parties that do it. You feel what I'm saying? And, and that's the point what keeps us out of LA all the way, all the way down to the max because the motherfucker just can't write. It's always a, 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 a nigga want to just do everything by himself. A nigga want to exclude his homies from this. A nigga saying he bigger than what he is. It's all these type of things going. So, man, y'all let me know in the comments, man. Y'all like and subscribe, man. You know, we going up. Y'all share the shit. Man, I really want to know y'all opinions on it, man. Because you see all these things that's happening right now. Before the, before the new year. 
We get ready to go to 2024, and you see how we're going into it? It's all type of 2023 shit that's about to get carried on into next year. Nigga gotta wash this shit off his hands. You feel me? Wash it off. You feel me? If shit ain't that bad, let it go. Start the whole new year. <laughs> Moving forward with nothing blocking you, you know what I'm saying? If you don't have something blocking you that you need to take down, Scoot that shit to the side. Keep moving forward. It's Diesel Talk, boy. I'm done.